بسم اللہ الرحمن الرحیم آج اس کتاب کا پارٹ ٹو ہم پیش کریں گے کیونکہ کتاب کافی اس کی سلائڈ زیادہ تھی اس کی سمری زیادہ ہے لہذا آج اس کی دوسری ویڈیو ہے اس کتاب کی سمری کی یہ واقعی ایک لائف چینجنگ کتاب ہے تو اس کا ہم نے کل پہلے حصے میں اس کی جو پہلا پارٹ تھا اس کا جائزہ لیا میں یہ بتا دوں واضح کرنے کے لیے کہ اس کتاب کے ویسے یہ سچ کوئی پارٹ نہیں ہے ہاں چیپٹر ضرور ہیں لیکن میں نے اس ویڈیو کو دو حصوں میں ڈیوائڈ کیا ہے تاکہ ایک ویڈیو لمبی نہ ہو یہ ساری ہم بات کر چکے ہوئے ہیں اس سے پچھلی ویڈیو میں آپ یہ تمام سلائڈز ملازہ کر سکتے ہیں تو اب ہم یہاں پہ تھے کہ واٹ آر تھرٹی ون میجر کازز آف ہیلیئر نمبر ون ان فیوریبل ہیریڈیٹری بیک گراؤنڈ نمبر ٹو لیک آف اے ویل ڈیفائنڈ پرپز ان لائف نمبر تھری لیک آف ایمبیشن ٹو ایم ابو میڈیکریٹی نمبر فور لیک آف سیلف ڈسپلن نمبر فائیو فیلیئر ٹو ٹیک ٹیو کیئر آف ونس ہیلتھ نمبر سکس پرو کریسٹینیشن پیپل ویٹ فار دی ٹائم ٹو بی رائٹ نمبر سیون لیک آف پرپز لیک آف پرزسٹنس نمبر ایٹ ریپلسو پرسنالٹی نمبر نائن نمبر ٹین لیک آف پاور آف ڈیسیجن نمبر الیون فیئر آف فیلیئر نمبر ٹویلو فیئر ٹو ٹیک کیلکولیٹڈ ریسکس نمبر تھرٹین رانگ سلیکشن آف ٹیم نمبر فورٹین فیلیئر ٹو ہیو اوپن مائنڈ نمبر ففٹین لیک آف کنسنٹریشن آف ایفرٹ نمبر سکسٹین فیلیئر ٹو سیو منی نمبر سیونٹین لیک آف انتھزم ایٹین ان ایبلٹی ٹو کوپریٹ ود ادرس انٹینشنل ڈس آنیسٹی یو مسٹ ہیو کیپیٹل انف ٹو ابزرو دی شاک آف یور مسٹیکس Our over-consciousness is as harmful for success as under-consciousness. Self-analysis analysis is must for improvement in your personality and personal services. Would you take your own services if you are put in the shoes of purchaser of your services? There is no free lunch. Decision. Never pro procrastinate. Don't get influenced. easily by the opinion of others when you reach decisions. Don't let your confidence shattered by the opinion or ridicule of others. Keep your own course. Keep your, keep your own counsel. Do it before you, before you tell the world that you intend to do it. The value of decisions depends upon the courage required to render them. Persistence. Persistence is directly proportional to the intensity of the desire. An unseen guide tests your persistence by offering temporary defeat or resistance. Foundations of persistence. Definite purpose, intense desire, belief in one's ability, definite plan of action, accurate knowledge, cooperation, willpower, relevant habit. Now you have to be aware of the following. Failure to define what you want. Procrastination. Lack of interest in acquiring specialized knowledge. Self-satisfaction. Blaming the circumstances. Quitting on the signs of defeat. Lack of desire. 
searching for shortcut fear of criticism the desire for success must be stronger than the fear of criticism five steps to develop persistence you must have a definite purpose burning desire definite plan a mind closed against all discouraging influences friendly alliance now coming to the power of the mastermind power in this context refers to the organized and intelligently directed knowledge sources of knowledge number 1 is infinite intelligence number 2 is accumulated experience number 3 is experiment and research every attempt that hasn't they that doesn't succeed is not a failure money is shy and elusive like a beautiful girl it is one by a determined lover now coming to sex transmutation it is just like the transmuting or transforming your urge your this natural urge into something more productive the purpose now what is the purpose the perpetuation of mankind health benefits transformation of mediocrity into genius it means switching off the mind from thoughts of physical expression to thoughts of some other nature it is the most powerful human desire it helps in developing keenness of imagination courage will power resistance and creative ability what you are required to do is just to transmute or transform or convert this energy into something more positive the same motivating force can be used in art literature art accumulation of riches etc it cannot and should not be suppressed it is irresistible the high achievers are those who have learned the art of using this power into some productive things the man who accumulated great fortunes in literature industry art architecture were motivated by the influence of a woman ten stimuli of the mind friendship number 5 master mind alliance mutual suffering art of suggestion fear so th- this one is negative this is temporary a man who has discovered how to increase the intensity of thought to the point where he can freely communicate with sources of knowledge not available through ordinary rate of thought is called a genius when brain action is stimulated through one or more of the 10 mind stimulants it lifts the individual far above the horizons of ordinary thought the reasoning faculty is often faculty they often faulty because it is guided by one's own accumulated experience which varies person to person ideas received through one's creative faculty are reliable for this reason your reasoning faculty will not allow you to set targets higher than you are already tapped already tapped potential when you are stuck in a problem and searching for its solution then do the following things have a clear picture of known and unknown factors this picture will take its solution and missing links from your subconscious mind genius status is acquired only when mind is stimulated to draw the forces available through creative imagination why men seldom succeed before 40 years of age the most productive years lie between 40 and 60 high achievers start learning the art of sex transmutation in their 30s the road to genius consists of the development control and use of following three emotions
Now this transmutation is possible by just redirecting your thoughts. For this, you have to identify which thought is positive and which thought is negative. Voluntary self-effort is the key to transmutation. Now, how you can do it? You just have to filter your positive and negative thoughts. Love stimulate the human mind to tap its potential. Failed love is a greater asset than successful love. Now, five media of personal magnetism, handshake, tone of voice, posture and carriage of body, the vibration of thought, body adornment. Now, you should know that you can use this power in a more productive way. Man's greatest motivating force is his desire to please women he likes. Like your goals with the player of the woman of your choice and your imagination are in reality. Now coming to the power of the subconscious mind. Your subconscious mind is like the backup of your mind. It works day and night. It connects finite mind with infinite, with infinite intelligence. Feed it with desires and positive emotions. Let no undesirable thought reach it. Only emotionalized thoughts influence it. It understands the language of emotions. Seven major positive emotions. Number one, desire. Number two, faith. Number three, love. Number four, number five. Number six, number seven. These are seven major positive emotions. Fill your subconscious mind with positive emotions. Seven major negative emotions to be avoided. Fear, jealousy, hatred, revenge, greed, superstition, anger. These are negative emotions which should be avoided. One kind of emotions has to dominate the others. By the law of habit, you can control which kind of emotion will dominate. Only that prayer brings result which has faith in it. Your subconscious mind is linked with infinite intelligence so it can bring a different plan or idea to fulfill your emotionalized desires. Now coming to the brain. We have limited our knowledge to physical, tangible things, yet... All of us are controlled by forces which are unseen and, and intangible. It has been determined that there are from 10 billion to 14 billion nerve cells arranged in different patterns in the human cerebral cortex. It is inconceivable that such an intricate network should be in existence for the sole purpose of maintaining physical body. How to join minds in a network? The sixth sense. It's a medium through which infinite intelligence may communicate voluntarily. It may warn you in times of danger. It may alert you to embrace opportunities on their time. Let great men shape your life. Make them your invisible counselors. The sixth Ghosts of fear, indecision, doubt, fear, the six basic fears. Poverty, criticism, ill health, loss of love, old age, death. How to control the fear of poverty? If you want riches, you must refuse to accept any circumstances that lead to poverty. Symptoms of fear of poverty, indifference, indecision, doubt, overcaution, procrastination. Burn your boats and make your retreat impossible. Poverty is a state of mind, change your thoughts. Seek the company of successful, 
blessed and talented ones. Theft in poverty is a great weakness of any human being. Just refuse to accept it. Don't compromise on your economy. Poverty is a curse. Poverty is suffering. Don't tolerate it. Riches are better than poverty without any shadow of doubt. Shadow of doubt. But riches must be earned through fair means. Poverty is better than riches earned through unfair means. But it should not be the option. Because fair means to earn riches are always available. Fear of criticism robs man of his initiative and kills his power of imagination. An estimated, an, an estimate showed that 75% of all people who visit physicians for professional services are suffering from hypochondria. Relieve yourself of all fears and worries because they are not worth the life and its players. Except death as an inescapable event. Protect your mind against negative influences. Do your self-analysis by asking relevant questions and answering them truthfully. It's a great fact that the one thing over which you have absolute control is your thoughts. Men with negative minds tried to convince Thomas Edison that he could not build a machine that would record and reproduce the human voice because this had no one else had ever produced such a machine. Having a mind is good, but having a control over it is a great blessing. How to control your mind? This is a question. Don't defend your failure by making an excuse for it. Take full responsibility of it. May all of you succeed in your endeavors. Thank you all. So this is a very interesting book. You should read it. I have just shown some of the highlights. And uh, you may have to read it because this is life-changing book. 